plenty of contenders to take this race out of this field. Jake Mitchell, the only sub 350 out of the prelims at 349.90. He's got a best time of 345.38. Top-ranked American, historically speaking, in this race is Kieran Smith out of lane five. He ranks number six all-time in this event at 343.94 for U.S. athletes. And it is Smith pushed the pace for the first 100 with a 53.94. Very fast opening speed there. Half second under world record pace. Second, you have David Johnston of Texas in lane six, out in the 54-4. Then Jake Mitchell at 54-6 in lane four. Through the third 50, Luke Hobson moving up, splitting at 28.6 from your tuned freestyle champion in lane two. Smith at 28.5. Completed and a 151.72 from Kieran Smith, still putting together a very fast time within a second of world record pace. American record 342.78 from Larson Jensen, that U.S. Open record 343.53. Jensen was out in a 151.1 when he did that performance. Johnson of Texas in second, Luke Hobson of Texas third from lane two. As things starting to heat up now as we get into the final three lengths. Maybe see those rally towels in action, ladies and gentlemen. Let these gentlemen know that you are here supporting them. Making some noise in what is shaping up to be a barn burner here in the final 110 meters. Can anyone challenge Kieran Smith, who's had the lead from the start? 29.5 on that 50. Moving up two spots over the last 100, Jake McGahee of lane three. He makes the turn for the last 100 at 250.94. Also moving up, Jake Mitchell in lane four. Mitchell now looks to be hitting a different speed as is McGahee in lane three, the NC2A runner up in the 500. McGahee with the lead, 50 meters to go. 319-18-28-2. McGahee, Mitchell, and Smith in the race to the finish. Mitchell still battling out of lane four. And the final touch is a 346.36. Jake McGahee, your national champion in lane three for Swim Atlanta. Jake Mitchell, 346.59 to take the silver. And Kieran Smith with a 348.48 is your bronze medalist.